I oh. make my willpower by one. Wow. Do you have a 60 year bear in Latin? No, I do not. I've got 40 something. Hang on a second. Give me a Latin roll to correct me, me just, pronounce the words. Yeah, yeah. Let me just reduce my hand first. Oh. Uh, what's this instant up? I'll get rid of that. Oh, hang on a second. What's instant up to? Uh, nah, don't need instant up. All right. Now, skills right down the bottom. Latin, 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 Latin. By a quarter. Yep. Okay. Um, yeah. It one of the faces kind of spin. It, you're holding the statue and it goes. Mm. I mean, yeah. You you kind of have to hold it in such a way that it can spin because yeah, 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 like super strong or whatever. But uh, one of the faces points back toward uh, the uh, place where you guys painted. Eventually, you discover where you painted the. the yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That, that's what I assume when it moved. That if it wasn't look, if it wasn't pointing to those <coughs> women, then yeah, maybe it's going to go it, to them. It, apparently, the statue has no interest in these women. Yes. Would you like to stick one in each deprivation tank? Just. To... <laughs> <coughs> no, All right, let, let's, go let's go back. To the <laughs> let's go back to there. Mm. What'd you do with the women? Rescue them? Nah, I stuck them in sensory dump tanks. Fuck them. Uh, we're not getting we're getting paid by the hour, so you gotta stretch it out. So, what are you doing now? We're going to check to see if the portal has opened up. How? Go back there. Poke yeah. it with my two meter pole. Uh, you're talking about the the black paint thing. Yes, because that's where the oh. head was pulling to. Yes, uh, no problem. Your uh, black pole sinks deep, deep into the. Uh, All right. So, so besides the women, do we want to take anybody else out with us if they can come out? With Are us? you wanting to take the women because they're not in a good way, and you guys have not been good for them. However, we may be able to take them somewhere where they actually get decent treatment. Is it? If this is the way out, are we sure we want to go out now? Um, just to give you a quick update, Doc, we unlocked the portal. And how was it done? We took, now this has probably got nothing to do with it, but just in case, we took all three women back to <laughs> the room of the woman that dreams of flowers. I then, I was then able to activate the statue and pronounce the words and it, and it turned and pulled towards the portal. We went downstairs and there's now, it's now a portal. But it shows you the exact same black painted uh, thing that, but now he's got a two meter pole. All he's got left is a handhold, and the rest of it apparently is through the wall. This could be a potentially a one way trip. Yes, so, exactly. Um, is there anything else we want to check out here before we leave? Hmm. Yes, it could be your one way ticket to midnight. Call it heavy metal. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Awful. What about the people? Mm. They look like they're really crazy, like super, super duper crazy. They're, we're not talking, nobody you've run into here has been a little crazy. I mean, yeah. the amount of craziness could even be expressed best with the aliens guy. So, uh, well, I still feel like we're missing something here. Um, <coughs> so what, we're just going to take the <laughs> woman, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the cutter, and the um, other woman, the young woman. You well, guys are pretty much almost carrying them around. like. Yeah, but that's right. the thing. don't know. Yeah, it's I'm of two minds if we... They may be just they may be just shadows, they may be just copies, they could be just I think it's worth reflect, trying, though, reflections of things. I think we leave the crazy people. 
Yes. We leave the crazy crying lady. We leave the fucking guy with the mask. He's going to try to eat our face off with a bar of beans and a bottle of candy. You've, you've not actually taken his mask off yet. I know, but I really want to. <laughs> <laughs> well, 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 no, well, before, before, we leave, before we leave, let's go back there and you can put, take his mask off. Right. Well, not through and, the fucking door he can't, apparently. And if, if he tries to go, if he goes to bite you, I can be standing next to him and I can grab him or something. I mean, the mm -hmm. mask, you undo the mask from behind anyway, so. Yeah. This comes as news to Alex Kinley, who believes that picking somebody up by their face is the way to do anything. I still, I, obviously, I couldn't get a good leverage from the um, from the front with the door in the way, but ripping the mask off from the back, that's still doable. <laughs> <laughs> Why have I got his head in my hand? <laughs> so you guys head back to that guy's room, toss open his door, mm -hmm. standing there in his bite mask, his straight jacket. No, you're not going to bite me, are you? Roar, roar. He says, yes. <laughs> Don't take me. I'll bite back harder. It does count as an unarmed attack, I guess. I do have bite <laughs> uh, There you go. <laughs> <laughs> I want to level it up more. Okay, 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 okay. Um, all right, yeah, we'll just uh, take his mask off. No problem. Uh, I have a picture of his face that I will now reveal. It's in the top left I am corner. Ready. I am tight like tiger. Ready. There you go. Mm -hmm. Hello, he says. Oh, yeah, nice. My name is Oliver. Oliver Fink. Yeah, so what are you doing here? I don't know. I think they brought me in by mistake, don't you know? Oh, Yes. 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 Right. <laughs> he shows you a lot of teeth. That's great. Also, sets an assembly deprivation tank for you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> he says, again? Yep. All right. You put him in there, shut the doors, and put heavy bricks on top. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> Freaking psycho. Yeah. <laughs> I'm kidding, man. Two cards. Take your cards, man. Oh, all right. He's, he's in the... But look, they must have loved me for that. Rags to riches. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, I'm working my way into the confidence. they like, oh, time for a little swim. And then the heavy breaks. He just... <laughs> He's like, that's not good. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> All right. He, he seems to have been secured. He's still in his straitjacket, too, <laughs> floating around with a fucking face mask on. <laughs> and I'm breathing through it, too. His, uh, cell now. <laughs> I don't suppose there's a... Mm, man. ITS written on his borders. <laughs> I uh, know he's got those other letters that you guys think may have been. Yeah. I no, yeah, no. Yeah, the uh, AD I, H O S S W on his wall. Okay, yeah. Well, his, oh, right, right, right. I, I stuck ATS in the electroshock therapy room that was before the one that had the lady who everybody thought was smoking a cigar in. Um, okay. Yeah. No, nothing in his room. Not even any windows. A lot of soft walls in here for some mm -hmm. reason. Didn't I thought the electroshock room had OT on the wall? No, there's two electroshock oh, rooms. There's two, is there? Yes, one right after another. <clears throat> uh, B, B was the electric shock room. It was burnt in with the burning tool. Yeah. yeah. Oh, sorry, yes, yeah. BE, yeah. that's right, yeah. So OT was the, um, yeah, so the original room. 
do, do we want to go and have a word with the crying lady just in case she knows anything? Yeah, we can try now that you're not freaking her out. Oh. Uh, no problem. Yeah, she she just looks very sad and she's just sitting there. Um, where? Oh, is she back in her room? I guess so. All right, she's just sitting in a uh, on a wet bed. All of her clothes are wet. It's good for you. Sorry. <laughs> they did actually give him cold treatment, Scarily. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Like yes, baths of ice and stuff. Um, what, what year is it? Um. Yes, I. I um. Uh, have you seen my baby? Oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs> right, I think we're going to need more heavy bricks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm going to recommend another session of these. <laughs> No, no, no. Leave her alone. <laughs> I was going to say, cut to <laughs> motherfucker. That's another problem sorted. <laughs> oh. Oh. That's crazy. Oh. She says, uh, I was brought here because of postpartum depression, but I'm feeling much better, doctor. I think I'll be ready to see babies. <laughs> oh, well, you seem yeah. to got your humor back. <laughs> hmm? Sorry. Pardon? I said I see, you seem to have had your gotten your humor back. No, <laughs> she's sad. <laughs> I know she is. I know she. <laughs> Oh dear, more heavy bricks, please. <laughs> oh dear. Classic line. Oh, oh man. Okay, uh, um. Oh, since where we what is, what is your name? She says Jane. Jane, and your surname? Russell? Jane Russell. Yes? Is it time for my usual treatment? Not at the moment. All right. Uh, what is that film with Bette Midler? Not Bette Midler. Bette Davis called Baby Jane? Whatever happened to Baby Jane or something? Well, now we all know what happened to fucking Baby Jane. <laughs> it wasn't pretty. No. It, it died hard. <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, Joan yeah, Joan Davis and Joan Crawford. Whatever happened to Baby Jane? Yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm hoping that the answer in the movie was not the same as in this campaign. No, 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 no. very different. All right, no but problem. Then again, I don't think Baby Jane in the movie was crawling around on the fucking ceiling. Wow. By the way, you guys can hear the wind coming in through the missing window with the popped out bars. Just FYI. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do we want to climb out and have a, have a look around? before we bugger off you would have to put some kind of um are we not interested in the um the other brick up door the in the reception the so one of the first ones we came across was that what we oh, came where, we, uh, where we appeared right so did we walk through that door logan and we turned around it was bricked up uh you walked through that door actually um uh, no, you walked through the door on the second floor, not the so first what, floor. I thought I must have missed. What, what's the picture in the top left-hand corner of the door bricked up? 
that's where you came from. Uh, but you don't know how you got there or if you walked through that door or what. You just kind of started there. Um, yeah, near the Warpy Hallway. Yeah. Yeah. Warpy Hallway on one side, bricked up door on the other, you in the middle. Uh, Chris dancing around, singing Stuck in the Mill with you with a razor blade. It's all there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. Um, well, I'm struggling to think of anything else to try out before we go through the door. Uh, I definitely think we need to take the statue head with us. If yeah, we I'm taking that. See if it'll uh, come with us. Um, yeah, I mean, as I said, that the only other thing is exploring outside if we want to have a look outside to see if there's anything out there. Is there, um, on, on the ground floor, is there not like a, a way out? Uh, there are several different possibilities. There's a bricked up entrance that looks just like the one that you started next to. Um, there is also um, there was a hallway with a door window at the end of it yeah um actually i don't think there's an air way out that you saw at the ground entrance uh the uh, the hallway, they have the uh, window at the end. The window looks like there was lights hidden behind the window. And then oh, okay. that's near that the uh, sensory deprivation the... tank thing. I was going to say, okay. the, um, the office had the painted window. We could just smash that open. Yes, you could go destroy a beautiful, detailed, almost true-to-life painting. If it, if it saves... The doc falling to his death, which is probably whiz waking <laughs> at the moment, then it's probably worth it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you guys head over to the doctor's office and once again utilize the power oh, of the two. Sorry, one more thing before we do that. Did you guys take the tag on the bag you found, or did you leave it on there? Right here. Oh, good. Okay, cool. Was there anything in that bag specifically as well? Which that bag was where now? the triangle was. I had that triangle. Ah, no. Okay. There was the, there was letters as well. Actually, with your with your earlier Ute roll that somebody had made for yes. reasons, uh, that's just like the lady's uh, uh, name and address and stuff, which <laughs> seems to be in Colorado. Um, you're doubting she's there now, of course, but. Seeing that her bag had dust on it and shit here. You didn't open it up and there's all these baby pictures were. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, it's just haunting me everywhere I go. Who knew punching one baby would be so traumatic for me? <laughs> it was a freaky baby, okay? <laughs> Even if it wasn't, I would say it has a fucking significant risk. Right. Smashy, smashy on the window. All right. Oh, that's where Devil's Tower is. Got it. Hmm. Huh? Devil's Towers. It's a rock formation. Okay. I don't know. I remember something about D holes living underneath it or some shit like that. I don't know. Spaceships land there. You know, good things. Nice. <laughs> the picture of the girl with the skull balloons, was that loose or was that actually on drawn on the wall? Loose. Okay. I'll grab that if it was loose. For some reason I just occurred to me I was thinking it was Yeah, so do I thinking it was actually drawn on the wall. We could just take that part of the wall if you wanted. <laughs> it wouldn't be, wouldn't be the first time the PCs ripped out part of a wall and lugged it off. Yeah. Well, Especially people people have been doing it with Banksy 
Mm -hmm. right. taking the walls. All right. With what? Um, Banksy's? Yeah, Banksy. He does um, graffiti art, but he's but he's become his artworks become quite popular, and it's worth lots and lots and lots, hundreds of thousands. Oh, I'd definitely rip down a wall and take it with me if it's hundreds of thousands because I could sell it and buy them a new wall and then profit. Profit! Profit! Leave them some underpants. Right. Is there anyone else we want to kill before we go or anything else we want to smash up? <laughs> I was going to say, you've still got one, one uh, of the immersion um, tanks left. Yeah, didn't you, you want to check out the doctor's? Didn't you want to see what was outside the doctor's window? Yeah. No problem. You guys head over there and smash the fuck out of it. It's got lights behind it in order to give it that true to life thing that it once had. It no longer has that. So what's behind that then? A uh, wall. Uh, yeah. Brick as in? Yeah. So the only way we know outside is via the I feel lucky, I feel happy room. Yeah. Right. I'm going to go back up there quickly, grab a bit of rubble. I want to throw it out. I want to see the rock hit the ground outside and start falling asleep at the desk. I, I woke up really early today, apparently. Um, yes, you guys, you guys uh, uh, do that. And yeah. Um, it doesn't get halfway down and go. Bruh, bruh, bruh. No, no. It doesn't come back and through the other side. <laughs> that would be awesome <laughs> if it did. But no, it, it looks it's just like throwing a normal rock out of a normal no, window. So it's not some weird Burlington pocket dimension. I didn't say that. I said it's just I know, like... I know. I, know. <laughs> <laughs> I got to smoke more to keep awake. Yeah. Smoking cures everything. everything. So... Uh, yeah. As far as I can tell, you guys have discovered two of the ways out of here. But yes. what to take? And for how long? And with whom? Hmm. Well, I suppose if we use... Oh, so, Doc, the, the drugs in the pharmacy, even though they're all nasty stuff, do you think... Three anything? ways, three ways, then. Overdose <laughs> is one. And... Yes, yes. <laughs> Did you, worth grabbing any of them to take with us? Ah, no, they're pretty much all just psychotropic drugs. I mean, if you want to trip for a while, hey. But other than that. Mm. Yeah, yeah. I think we should take them. <laughs> take what you want, then. <laughs> I mean, hey. But don't I that mean, you could sell them on the take. street. You could probably sell them and get some money, you know, too. I mean, not yeah. a whole hell of a lot, but, you know. Mm-hmm. Uh, Get your, you know, money. drug dealing off to a good, you know, start. <laughs> nah. Alex is a new orange. I don't do money. But standing outside of school, giving them to kids, yeah, that's my idea of fun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow. I cannot stop right. the guy eating uh, something with his feet. That's just brilliant. <laughs> You keep coming, going back and looking at it, do you? I definitely want him in a sensory tank. <laughs> <laughs> him in a sensory tank, full up of bloody uh, 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 illegal narcotics with heavy rocks on the lid. <laughs> um, did we check out the broken doll? I know we looked in and saw a broken doll there, but we did. did we yeah, go and the party it went, meh. And moved on. They said, nah. Let's check it out. You do so. There's nothing special about it. It's just a broken doll with a smashed head. Just say it to look spooky. Yes. Well, it was working for a short time, but then the party's like, we're going to stick you in this century depth tank and put heavy rocks on the lid because you are sad, bitch. <laughs> How you no, feel we now? We haven't done that to her. And oh, did that to Mr. T. Ah. Um, question, Logan. The uh, can with the black paint in it, is it empty now that we've done the door, or is there still some in it? No, it looks like there's enough for 
four more of the. the, the oh, really? Yes. Oh, take your can with the black paint and the paintbrush. Yep, yeah, definitely take that. Oh, I assume that we still had it with us. Um, I didn't. It's a pain in the ass carrying paint can around. Well, Is we it? can leave it by the door and then pick it up and carry it through with us when we leave. Worst Done. Comes to worst, we just we just take some pillowcases. Oh, is there a lid there for it? A what? Lid. lid. Oh, yeah. Yes. Oh, we'll put the lid on it so it doesn't spill. We can grab some pillowcases. Oh, we've got suitcases. We don't need pillowcases. We'll just grab some suitcases and put, put stuff in it, if necessary, or pillowcases <laughs> to carry stuff. We're going to completely loot this place. <laughs> Done. You know what we could do for the hell of it? It might not be worth anything. I'm sure Logan will be like, yeah, it's not worth it. But we can go and check out these uh, the names of these people in the, the file room. Jane Just Russell. Yeah. yeah, we can check to see if we can find files for them in the file room, if there's anything. In the file room? File. File. File room. Who, files on who, though? Like, so Jane Russell, the patient. Oh, yeah. No, they're... they're, they're... Pretty much, uh, doctor wants to give him a straight jacket and then enema. That's what all not in that order. <laughs> yes, it is. Straight jacket enema. Straight jacket enema. Wow. Yep. Yep. Cool. Why is this all in your handwriting, Alex? <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going to say the doc there. <laughs> I can see him doing that as well. Yes. It's wide open. All I'm, right. I'm sure just a picture. But is the there picture, any? Oh, sorry, the picture of the, um, the the head doctor's office. Yes, it's got like a lamp with that shade on the floor. Is that just the picture, or is that? Right. Yes, I, I. It's as close as I can get to no, a room that, office. That's very weird. Yes. So, which ah. way out do you guys wish to attempt to oh, go? Okay. Well. Now we've got the paint, because I was worried about if we went through the other door, we'd never be able to find our way back here. But I didn't say you would be with the paint, but, you know, well, if nothing else, you can paint. do part of our room. Four more charges. Wow. If it works. Yeah, if it works. If it works. Yeah, it could be unique to this place, but I don't know. All right, Ooh. so we're going to try We're going to try and take the Mildred-like women with us. And Well, in that, in that case, it definitely might not be worth climbing down, because if they mess up, yeah, I mean, at the very least, even if they're just images, duplicates, whatever, not the real, and we can try and get them better treatment than they're certainly getting here. Yeah. Okay, I guess we go and um, go through the portal. Through the, or when you say the portal, are you talking about the black paint thing? Yes. All right. Uh, so, Alex begins walking toward it. He's carrying a can of black paint. Yes. And that's it. We so. have the we have the statue. Yeah, yeah. we're taking the statue. We have uh I have the symbol. You got the triangle. And the two yeah. women. And the two women. Okay. No problem. Even depending uh, on depending on how mobile they are compass mentis, we'll use wheelchairs for them. Wheelchairs done. Yes, they're in the old fucked up, uh, horrible wheelchairs. So yeah, uh, Alex pushes one through, and they disappear. Yep, I'll go. You go next with the. I'm just trying to think. Should you go next with the head, or should I go through with the woman? You go through with the woman. Yep. All right. Bloop. Since uh, Alex, do you have the? Do I have the stat? Who has the statue? Do I have it you, or? You do at the moment, I think. Okay, I should be last to go through then. So you yeah. got one of the women with you, or two? No, no. Four. Alex went through first with one woman. Yes. I went through second with the other woman. Okay, and then Chris is going to club one with a statue, chop off her head, <laughs> and stick it with the statue <laughs> on her body, no, no, and then. Stick it in the sensory depredation tank. And yeah. then cover it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so is the statue of the woman or Chris that's going to be in the sensory depth tank? He's getting Colonel Mustard with the statue. 
<laughs> and the axe. In the swimming room. Wow. In the swimming uh, room. <laughs> so in the which, conservatory. Which which woman are you guys leaving behind? Uh, okay. Uh, we're leaving the, the crying woman with the yeah Jane Jane Russell because she did not look like. So we're, we're taking the one first into bits of paper, and we we took the one that looks like Mildred. Yeah, because they they both look like Mildred. Of course, you are missing her. I understand. <laughs> All right, because so, we don't know whether or not they're parts of Janice or not. Got it. So then Chris lugs his statue through and tells it it looks like Mildred. That's right. Okay. So you guys all emerge in the uh, office. There's no gate on the wall behind you. Uh, it looks like some sort of office building, and there's a guy dressed in 1950s clothes at a desk with a pipe in his mouth. And he goes, hello, sport. Happy Friday. Oh, Happy Friday. <laughs> <laughs> so what's so how are the bobcats going? Oh, those bobcats, he says. Go bobcats. Go bobcats, yes. How can I help you? You call. All right, then, he says, and he goes back to just staring into the middle distance with his pipe in his mouth. Where, where, uh, where is this? Are we in the office? Yes. Isn't it? This is the office, he says. <laughs> yes, the office, he says. What floor is this? The second floor. There's the window. Oh. And what department is this? This is the department. Of course. Mm-hmm. Now I'm going to turn back around quickly when we, the wall we came through. Uh, quicker. There's nothing there. On the wall. Oh, certainly. Uh, I get it. Cool. You still need a way to see the magic, though. Well, it? Not really, but your analyzed magic, uh, since you did make it, your guess would be you just came through a one way gate and now you live here oh, well, with these two women. Oh, well. You have chosen poorly. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, you you live here. That's that's cool. Um, uh, but, Alex, an odd I thing has open. happened. An odd thing has happened. For some yeah. reason, uh, you each have two additional tarot cards. Which Ooh, that is very odd. odd. Yes. I'm uh, starting with tacos, uh, ten of swords, two of wands. And uh, those two, uh, two feet. There you go. Okay. Uh, <laughs> two wands. Yeah. Uh, was, cards um, were, yep. Kinley's cards is the Empress and the Queen of Pentacles. Oh. I really thought you said Queen of Pentacles there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the queen of testicles. I go both ways. And uh, let's see. Uh, uh, McKay's cards is Wheel of Fortune and Seven of Cups. Wheel of Fortune. Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> oh, I, there was some fucking horrible Wheel of Fortune slot machines. And they would do that, having the audience yell Wheel of Fortune every couple of minutes. Ugh. Hoping to get some idiot over there playing, and no idiots wanted to go play. But with the, with the 12 tarot cards we currently have, mm -hmm. uh, do any of them have any differences about them to normal tarot cards? Because previously, mm -hmm. one of them had, previously, for example, uh, one of them had Maddie on them, one of them yeah. had Alex on them, the tower they, they we recognized. Did. No, these appear to be standard Rider White okay. or Weight deck. Weight, yep, yep. Yeah. Okay. So, um, and, and we're still in the uniforms we're in? Yeah. Okay. So, there's a window 
if you wanted to, Chris could throw the statue through it, and you guys all dive after it like lemmings. So we've got we've got the two women who are still with us. They're yeah, still yeah, they 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 they're not looking great right now, possibly due to things. <laughs> well, one was one was given electroshock therapy. The other appears to have managed to make herself dissolve and then come back. And then I think both of them were put in a sensory depth tank for a while. And <laughs> they've had a full day. <laughs> Hmm. Ah, <clears throat> and everybody give me a spot hidden roll. Go to nothing special. You see outside of the window, in addition to the normal Burlington crowd, which all of you know super well, um, you also see some other people wandering around. Okay. As in. You're going to guess Kinleyville Heights or something? Yeah, I was going to say from the way they're dressed, do they look like mm -hmm. Kinleyville people? Well, it's it's hard to say because the Kinleyville fashion, it's like we raided 1950s clothes shop and we make our own clothes here and then we combine the two for maximum strangeness. Are they, do, are they doing their pulling down buildings for resources stick? Um, yes, some of it, but also, uh, they're, they're like looking around a lot. They seem worried. Okay. Say hello. Yeah, see what's going on. Would you like to smash out the window and go that way no. or go down the stairs? Carefully down the stairs. No problem. Uh, and no, we're not pushing the wheelchair down and letting go of it first. Well, you know what? <laughs> no. Yeah. Uh, can you can you go do have some mighty good healers? The the ladies might be. Hmm. Uh, it's a different place to dump people. Cool. Uh, you well, guys. Go out I mean, the whole purpose of bringing them out is to take them somewhere where they're going to get better treatment. Ah, okay. I wasn't sure why. I thought you were just capturing random people for fun. No, 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 no. It was to try and get them better treatment, especially because the one causing the the weird paper and all that sort of stuff. Then. Well, they both seem to be causing weird stuff from happening. So whether or not they are some link with Janice, got or it. Not. As soon as as soon as they see uh, you guys, they're like, oh, and then they see Alex, and they go, oh, 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 oh. but <laughs> they come rushing. They come rushing over, and they go, oh, thank God you're here, Mr. Kinley, and Mr. Kinley's friends, uh, and other strange women. You don't look good. They and anyway. We don't know what to do about the big block thing, sir. The what, what now? The big block thing. It's you mind pointing the direction of... Sorry? They all point. Sure. Uh, they, they're all pointing uh, in the same direction, except what, one to, guy. To, to, towards the big whirlpool? No, uh, toward the uh, the wrap, wrap area in the forest where the zone... Uh, uh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So where the where the gate was previously that we we severed on the nose. Oh, we better get round to making our level one magic fetishes. And... <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, you, yeah. Uh, we don't know what to do about it. Okay, okay. Sure, have a look then. All right. Uh, so, are you going? Volunteers did, push did you, the wheelchair for you. Thank you. Did you guys? Did you guys come here via the ship or yeah. via? Yes. Plans? Well, we've we've got we've got plans that we we're going to need help with. Uh, we're going to ask Mr. Kinley and, of course, you guys. They say covering quickly. Yes. So um, who who's the commanding officer here with you at the moment? Um, Mr. Pickles. Yes, yes. They usher in. Hold on, I've actually got a picture of Mr. Mr. Pickles. You got a picture of him now? Oh yeah, oh yeah. I've had a picture of him. I just didn't know where it was. And ah, let's see. And there he is. And 
here is Mr. Pickles. Hello. <laughs> awesome. Isn't that fucking adorable and hideous? All uh, Mr. Pickles. Oh yeah. He's 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 in charge. Everybody likes him, and right. yeah, he has the full Kinley support. <laughs> Uh, as you guys are walking over there, Mr. Pickle says, you know, Alex, we're worried about this, this new thing because of uh, the bridge that we're wanting to make and the water monster that we're wanting to avoid because there's a lot going on. Plus, we've been hearing rumors that down in Kinleyville and stuff, off to the east in the swamp, there may be trouble brewing. Oh, that's my favorite type of brewing trouble uh actually it's whiskey sir no, but no. <laughs> whiskey and trouble yes uh so what we're what we're working on doing we want to get uh, a bridge set up so that we can uh raise and lower things we want to bridge over the whirlpool It'll be a big project uh but we're also wanting to make it so that uh uh, we can close and open the whirlpool gate at will because we don't want any more of the dinosaurs with the lasers or whatever stuff coming through and getting us. So we're going to need help with that because we don't even know how to start. Plus, on top of that, there's some sort of big monster thing. Nobody's gotten a good look at it, but it's been trying to swim up the whirlpool and it almost succeeded a couple times. We're worried if it goes up through the waterfall, it will come here into Burlington. We don't know what kind of effect that will have. Hmm. And on top of that, because there's not enough going on in your life, one of the girls in the wheelchair is like, just like, <laughs> and there's this. Everybody give me a sandy roll as they take you right to the fold, the space-time fold and stuff that you've been to, unless you have space-time maxed out. I don't like this. Uh, it's D6 if you fail, one point if you succeed toward space-time. <laughs> one point if you succeed? Yes. <laughs> Alex goes, oh, yes, we thought the same thing too, sir. Um, it looks like uh, construction has begun on what appears to be some sort of big block thing. It's, say, 30 meters by 10 meters. Nobody around is is making it or whatever. It looks like it's just uh, it's it's not one solid piece. It looks like it's made out of bricks and stuff, but it's going to be a big rectangle thing, maybe uh, two meters high by thirty by ten. Right. So who's building this? We don't know. Why haven't we just torn it down? Um. We don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing. Uh -oh. yeah. We're not sure what's going on with it, who's doing it, why, what the purpose is. So we're worried about if we tear it down, says Mr. Pickles. If we tear it down, excuse me, Mike didn't mean to growl like that. Uh, then we may be fucking ourselves in the ass with a dildo and no lube. Very wise. But now that you're here, you can put everything to right. Have you had people observing it? I uh, know we, we don't have enough people for that. We've got people that are currently uh, working on so many things. We've got a lot of guards and stuff trying to keep the, uh, the whirlpool safe on our end. We've got people that are also trying to uh, scout. Uh, we have been trying to make trades and stuff with some of the... Uh, with the, uh, What's the trouble with the swamp? We're, we're hearing bad things. Hornsby, you remember Hornsby? Yeah. He, he was out there with a team looking for new stuff, and apparently the swamp has some good shit in it. But... Uh, there's some weird tribes people out there, and they're they're saying that the chosen one's gonna visit soon or something. I am the chosen one. Well, you better get out there then. <laughs> yes. All right. So yeah, there's a little bit of going on. It's been a couple months since we've seen you though. I'm so happy I came back here. All right. 
trip. Not only did I have a plate like this, now I've got a plate like this. <laughs> so, Mr. Yeah, Pickles. I more the... shit onto the plate, get higher and higher and higher. The relocating Clems project, how did that go? The rebuilding uh, Clems re project. Yeah, not good. Not good. We can't move it, but uh, we've got under a super heavy guard. We've tried building a new one also so we can have multiples. Not happening. And nobody, I, we did a lot of questioning and stuff because, um, you know, to find out what the fuck. But, so, so when you were taking piece by piece from, because the whole thing was taking piece by piece from the Clems here, relocating it because it kept rebuilding itself we we're Until trying to you... but then the parts go away there and they're back here and we don't know why oh, okay so they don't so they don't stay where you take them to now um now, I think uh, you're Dar try darius, darius, darius thinks that they may grow naturally okay but uh, well it may have been claire's theory but you know darius is definitely taking credit for that one <laughs> Okay. <laughs> ah, he starts stop it, stop it, he says as you begin telling him. Okay. He's got well, a lot that of been good if that worked. tech on him, by the way. Mm -hmm. Awkward tech. <clears throat> right. So how when did when did people first notice this big rectangular thing? Um That'd be on Friday. And girl, prior girl, to girl Friday, turned. when was the last? Prior to Friday, when was the last time? Well, see, that's the here? troubling thing is it's always Friday, so we're not sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah but from time using the time, time, using the time frame from MMO land. Oh, that'd be about eight, nine days. Okay. And is she all right? Uh, we rescued him from a from an asylum, a very primitive asylum. Oh, why are they wet? We were trying something. <laughs> it didn't work the way we expected. <laughs> he just narrows his eyes and looks at you. So while we're here, actually, we can get him some towels and some clean clean clothes and he, he, he has a couple of the women women thank you yes i was yeah. going to ask if there were women in the crew oh yeah they they have a lot they they're yeah i assume i assume it, they did yeah yeah, you know, yeah I mean, they can get some women to get them dried up and get them some clothes magic doesn't work with the shit up here can't no, exactly. just, just attend to them you know, you... oh no yeah we, we we got some people with basic first aid yeah. hello i am zoot <laughs> and right <laughs> they uh, basic first aid training. Uh, yeah, they, they're going to take him off to the the uh, um, guest house. Yes. Yeah, no problem. When they say guest house, give me a memory roll, Alex. Yes. You begin hearing porno music in your mind playing, and the, it shows the camera slow panning over the bar in the guest house. <laughs> 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 it just shows all the bottles like super shiny reflecting I, light. I think in bling, bling, bling. Oh, the <laughs> oh, yeah. They have a lot of alcohol there now you think about it. Yes. You begin drawing just like a girl in a wheelchair. Hold it back, Alex. Hold it back. <laughs> right. Everybody's looking at you like you've suddenly become much more twitchy lately. Right. Okay. Uh, yeah, sure. second win. Um, is Chris doing okay or is he just still thinking and shit? No, there's. I'm doing fine. Cool. Okay, so. Um... Which one do we start? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck you people. I got uh, missions and shit. Uh, well, we could go Plus, to... that's your secret of Salt Marsh. <laughs> I 
I'm going to check the bricks. Like, is there, like, what, is it just, like... Give me an architecture or construction role. Yeah. They, they look like kind of those uh, large reddish bricks and stuff that are, they're not shocking in any way or whatever. Uh, yeah. Do they look like the bricks of the of the of the buildings around here? No. So are they actual look like manufactured bricks with you know manufacturer stamp and that sort of stuff? Or do they uh, look like someone who's made them? I'm going to go uh, kind of in the middle. They they look like they've been mass produced, but there's no manufacturer stamps and shit on them. Okay. They they were they were mass produced by a very shy manufacturer, who didn't want anybody else buying shit from them. I'm guessing when you try and go around it, you just run into some physical barrier. Uh, no, you you uh, you can you can walk all the way around it. It's uh, and you, it, uh, they're not right against the barrier. So if you go to go around it, you pop out the other side. Well, you do, but then you pop back in when you can okay. around it. It's just it's a disorienting place. It's like going through a fun house of mirrors, but you can literally walk all the way around the thing. Does it look like it's a, a building or is it solid? Uh, it's pretty, It's it looks like it's going to become something, but you're not sure what. Do uh, they... It looks like when you go around to the back that there are like these metal door things on it. They're man size, maybe bigger. We call it kick down the doors in. <laughs> I don't recommend trying it with metal. I mean, you are freakishly strong, so you might be able to do a uh, fucking... <laughs> well, okay, yeah, that wasn't where I was going, but it's possible, I suppose. <clears throat> I mean, do the... you can go... Rah! On the metal doors or whatever, if you really wanted to try it that way, we need to get a bathroom room, Mr. Pickles. Why don't you try me? opening one, just seeing if it opens. Or just open the door. <laughs> 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 there you go. Are uh, you going to just open the door? Well, if Pete says, oh, yeah, try and open the door. Oh, uh, give me a strength roll at full. Uh, uh, yeah, curious to see what happens. Go for yeah, that. Right. He goes, Bleh! and then looks at you. Shall I get that battering ram, says Mr. Pickles, being as smart as. Very well. He just looks at his first mate. His first mate's like, bad dog, bad dog, like, not a dog. <laughs> With right. the, the brickwork, does it go, is it flush with the barrier or does it look like they no. protrude into the barrier? There's there's some there's some space between the two so you can walk okay, around. Okay, there's a gap. Okay, kind of yeah, weird. I wasn't sure. But inside, yeah. it looks like there's a large ramp thing that goes steeply down. You could walk down it, but it's steep. I mean, if you if you wanted to do a somersault down it, you could, but... You know, you could just walk down it. If only we had some skateboards. Oh, yeah. And light sources. And, yeah. Uh, yeah. Mr. Pickles, skateboards and light sources. <laughs> <laughs> how, how, how big, works. sorry, how, how big is it? I'll have the skateboards fetched from the... Uh, no, 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 I'm not even joking. Just light sources. No, no, we've got them. We got them. Got them how, big, how, how big is how big is the avenue? Uh, the avenue, avenue is probably uh, around twenty meters wide. So we could get in one of these cars and drive down. Yes, yes, you could. Fuck, and that, what? Yeah, that is pretty amazing. It's a good way to get a check and drive car at last, I guess. But yeah, here's a, have a card. Yeah, I didn't even think about it. Yes, you could go get a fucking car. Yeah. I mean, we'll take other light sources, but that'll give us lights as well. That will definitely give you light. Uh, right, the crew guy comes back with three skateboards and uh, a sack of uh, uh, torches. Lovely. Good skateboard, sir. 
What is the uh, what's the penalty for trying to cast magic in this area? Uh, you're not sure because uh, there seems to be some different shit going on oh, here really? than uh, was previous, but you can always try it and find out. Just yeah, to make sure fine. you're not in viewpoint of the citizens. No, well, I'm, 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 I'm standing in the doorway to the downstairs bit that's at the back of this uh, glass, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, back of this building. I'm, I'm curious to see what it takes. Me too. Yeah. Hold on a minute. Where is it? Uh... You suck, Logan. I know. Oh, I know. I'll be right back. Uh All right, uh, give me a willpower times one roll. Oh, Arlington. Oh. Magic doesn't work here. <sighs> it's gotten a lot harder, has it? Apparently. It has hardened against magic. Hmm. I'm glad that uh, Pete was here to make notes of all the new plots and shit going on here. <laughs> Indeed. I like probably that. Missed, Matt probably missed some. I'm glad that Matt was here to complain about all the new plots. <laughs> <laughs> How about um I want to attempt my servitor power. I want to see if that is affected by the same magic dampening. What is your servitor power? Uh quick. Uh, basically a haste. Yeah. I'm uh, sure go ahead and roll that shit. Roll, roll. You will know, roll a will times one first. No, the skill. No. Yeah, it's probably badly affected. <laughs> <You're sorry. laughs> or, or you're just incompetent. You have no idea which, but it's frightening well, either way. Until we decide what we're doing, I will literally just stand there and keep trying until it goes. He stands there going. <laughs> 